Hello YouTubers, I'm Justin and today on Dash and Run where we're doing another one of my quick unboxings and this time we're going to be looking at a microphone and if you know from my past videos I actually quite like microphones and this particular microphone is a Sennheiser and it's an MKE200 and it's a microphone for on top of a camera and it is quite a nice size microphone. So anyway, like all my videos, let's get it out the box and have a bit of a closer look and see if there's something you might want to get for your camera. So the first thing out of the box is this paperwork and basically this has got the quick guide, the guide and the warranty card for the microphone and they give you an actual paper version of all of that which is really nice. Next is a couple of cables we've got here. We've got one that you could use for on camera and one is for a smartphone so they give you two different cables and I also like the fact that they've gone with a blue colour instead of a red colour that you often see with other brands of microphone. Next is this particularly very soft, uh, very nice looking um, wombat or furry dog or whatever you want to call it. Basically it's a um, wind breaker device to help uh, stop wind going over the microphone. But this particular one is very nice and soft and I also like the fact they went with a black colour instead of a sort of a dull grey colour. So it's a really nice looking um, wind sock this one. Also comes with an official uh, little bag to have your microphone and everything in, but it is only a soft draw bag, which is okay, but um, probably won't use that for the microphone. And finally, we've got the microphone itself. And as you can see, it's of an interesting design. It's a more uh, stubby and sort of uh, flat nose type microphone instead of a very long sort of uh, microphone and thin and narrow like you often see with these kind of microphones. Now, it basically doesn't have any um, sound dampening on the outside because it's included inside internally this one so the microphone is on a, a little device that stops it from picking up sound and that's internal instead of external like some of the other brands you may have seen it does have a standard screw thread for the hot shoe cold shoe and you've got a mount on the bottom too where you can mount it on a little tripod one unusual aspect I noticed though is it, um, an output basically on the front of the microphone which is kind of unusual because I would have expected it coming from the back but uh, I suppose they decided to go from the front underneath but um, overall it feels reasonable quality I mean it is made of a, a plastic um, but it does feel quite sturdy and quite nice so next let me just um, hook this up and I'll give you a quick sound test and then we'll wrap this video up Okay, so now I've hooked up the MKE200 microphone and the audio you're listening to is actually coming from that microphone. So I'll give you an idea if it sounds reasonably good. Now it is an on-the-top camera microphone where normally I'd use a lapel type microphone, but it seems like the uh, audio is coming through quite strong and clear and hopefully this will give you an idea if it's something you want to get for your own camera equipment. Anyway, let's go wrap this video up. Well there you go, there's my quick unboxing and audio test of the MKE200 Sennheiser microphone and overall I think this is a pretty decent microphone and if you're after one that's good for using for blogging work or basically you want to catch your audio out on the field, this is perfectly good for this. It's not overpriced which is great and it does give you an alternative to some of the other microphones that are out there as well. So for me I can definitely recommend it. Anyway, I'm Justin and as always, thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel.